Uh, guys, it's News Now, Ohio. So, we got, this is Officer Wynn right here. I think he's going to get out and fuck with him, these guys over here, because they're burning a bunch of nasty shit in their yard like a bunch of idiots. And, I mean, it's stinking up the whole fucking neighborhood. I don't know who called, but, or if you just drove, happened to drive by and see it. But right there, guys, I'll show you. Look. Look, look at these idiots. Look at this. Fucking idiots, man. <laughs> Fucking idiots. Whole neighborhood stinks. Yep, there he is. Oh, he's definitely going over there to say something. It smells like, I don't know what they're burning, guys. Oh, my God. I mean, that's just plum ridiculous. Damn. Damn, it's as far up as it'll go. It's just ridiculous, guys. He was on me, though, guys. I was. I got somebody called me and said, "Hey, the cops are just sitting down here on the corner, just sitting there." So I got up and got dressed, my shoes and shirt jacket on, and walked down to the corner. And as soon as I turned the corner, I saw him and started uh, to get my phone out. He just come. He just pulled away, and there he come. Then he come down here. So, yeah, look at these idiots, man. What the fuck? These guys are plump, fucking retarded, man. Wow, man. Wow. Pollute much? Damn. That's just ridiculous, man. Holy shit, dude. That's just ridiculous. What in the hell are they burning over there? I mean, I don't know what it is, but it stinks. The whole, it, the whole neighborhood stinks. I mean, it almost smells like burning plastic. Wow. I don't know where the cop went. He was just right there. I don't know if he went around. Or... Oh, there he is. Oh, yeah, he did go around. He went in the backyard. Oh, no, he didn't go. Oh, really? I swear to God, dude. Sorry, guys. Phone call. Oh, yeah, he did. was in their yard. I guess. I don't know. I don't know. That's just crazy. Wow. Yeah, he's knocking on that back door. There ain't supposed to be nobody there. No, nobody's supposed to live in that house. Uh, uh, I don't even love any man. Really? I mean, I guess if you don't live there, you, know, you wouldn't have a choice. Ain't supposed to be. Damn, they went in and shut the door. Like, get comfortable, officer. Holy shit. Yeah, there's not that. Uh, that's that abandoned apartment. That the drugs over the guys, over, the people overdose that ever almost every day.
pretty interesting. I wonder what's going on in there. I think. I don't know, I guess. Is he knocking on the apartment? Uh -huh. All right, guys. Let's move on. Uh, no, nah, I didn't really say much of anything. Except that they're stinking the whole neighborhood up. <laughs> what was they burning? Huh? It sure stank. I can't hear you. A ride along? No, every time I ride along with you guys, I go to jail. <laughs> I might do that, though, just for shits and giggles. Be good, man. All right, guys. That's Officer Wynn. He's all right, guy. He's he's not a bad guy. I mean, he, as long as you are you don't break the law, he's cool, man. You know. I mean, he's still a cop, though. I mean... You know, but as far as being corrupt, I don't think he's corrupt. But is he against or is he above uh, doing an illegal search? No, I don't think he is. But that's for all. That's all of them. But he just asked me if I wanted to do a ride along. I was like, yeah, no, I'm good. Every time I ride along in that thing and one of those, I go, I'm, I'm my final destination is the jail. So I'm good. <laughs> all right, guys. Well, I'm out. Uh Looks like uh, he made them put it out, he said, because they were burning something. He didn't say what they were burning, but I guess that's all the white smoke that was there was them pouring water on it. But wow, man, it was it was pretty horrible. <laughs> all right, y'all. Uh, it's going to be uh, News Now House getting ready to sign out. I really need to get me a car. i got to get my car going, guys. It's a... Uh, uh, no, I'll just bring it back here and let you guys see real quick. Uh, look, at that, look at that shit over there, guys. Look at that. Look at a bunch of nasties. A bunch of nasties. Look at that mattress, guys. Wouldn't you like to sleep on that mattress? Tell me, you guys. You, know, you all know you'd like to sleep on that mattress. Come on, now. Come on, man. Clean that right up, guys. That'll shine right up. I was trying to ride on up. <laughs> oh my God, dude, that's disgusting. And guys, that didn't just happen because they had it out here. That's what it looked like when they, oh crap. That's what it looked like when they brought it out. All right, let me show you guys something. Okay, let me show you what's going on with my car. So you guys can see it. So, tires off already. Oh, well, I just can't really see much, but I, there. That's what I need to fix, guys. Is is the shock? I don't know if you guys can even see that, man. But the shock right there, the coil spring that was somewhere. I don't know where it was, but it fell off. So it fell off, and we're going to uh, we're going to uh, uh, put new. We're going to put some air shocks on it, guys, so that uh, it. Uh, it, I don't need to put the, the, you know, the coils on it after that. That'll be fine. So that's what my plan is. So, all right, guys. News now. Hiles out.